Ooh. I see the page coming in everything. Yeah. Take me home, yeah. What's up? Mike Beasy. You know, guys, for the people who watched, you're going to love this story. For the guys who watched today's Home Depot video, you saw me super excited and just full of cheer over the possibility of getting that rigid, rigid compressor 18 volt for $50, right? Fung Hun Han, what up, buddy? Len Hendricks, what's up, buddy? Good to see you. 94 GT, what's up, what's up? Logan P. But $50, man, I was going nuts. I was going nuts for $50. So, as you know, I had the com rigid 18-volt compressor, and I had the 56-piece Milwaukee Shockwave impact set, you know, with the removable storage, right? It was $19.99 down to $14.99. So, I'm just doing my own little thing there. Check it out. Self-checkout. Beep. My Milwaukee shockwave kit 56 piece comes back at 19.99 my like, whoa 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 what's going on here i need a little customer service uh, excuse me ma'am so the lady comes over fixes it i scanned it you have to scan that little yellow coupon you know a little yellow tag that says it's discounted so all of a sudden, I'm like, oh, all right, let's uh, put the compressor up on the self-scan. Now, if this lady hadn't have been there, can somebody guess how much I would have paid for that freaking compressor? If she just wasn't there, if I just minded my own freaking business, my own goddamn business. Tool Guy Ty, what's up? And I'm still, like, sick to my stomach. And I almost vomited on the way home. There was actually phlegm that built up. At one point, there was phlegm. Tool guy, Ty. I would have gotten it for a freaking penny. You creep! You bastard! You bastard, you... So, once the lady saw that I was going to get this big, beautiful, one pound, 120 PSI compressor for a penny, of course. Whoa, 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 something's wrong here. And then uh, a man came over in shorts, a Home Depot employee in shorts, and said, no, 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 can't sell it for you for a penny. They write it off. Yeah. I would have cost me a penny. But. I have to put my. Oh. Tool guy tie. Sorry to hear that bro. I mean, you know what. And that is the reason. Why I don't. Get animals. Honestly. Um, you know. We got Blackberry. And cats are a little bit different. Because they live. You know. You can get. 15 16 you know i didn't think the oldest cat is like 33 years old you know cats live a little bit long but i had a dog growing up you know i think i got my dog duke his name was duke when we were when i was probably around 10 and it died when i was 22 12 years also but let me tell you it's like uh literally you know a family member dying so and it was just oh it was the whole it was horrible 
And I swore I would never get another animal, another pet, to go through that terror, horror. So I feel for you, tool guy. It definitely is. I would say, right, Richard? You take it for a penny. Yeah, sorry to hear that, my man. But we got something here, guys, and oh yeah. I know, it is, um, I'm at a complete, I never felt, oh yeah, it's, it's horrible, man, you know, especially with dogs, now, I've, I've kind of had cats too, my whole life, and, you know, one particular cat I had, I was close to, you know, years ago, 20 years ago, but, you know, yeah, it's different with cats, I don't know why, but with dogs, oh no, no. It is, uh, it is brutal. And um, I feel for you, brother. Well, sometimes it's good to come over and come on here and you got some support for some good people. And that's what you guys are. You're good people. You know, in a world of terrible people, um, there's a lot of great, good people out there. And I'm sure you guys know it too. And um, you come across them, some times every day you'll come across a good person but um that's what this is a group of good people when when something sad like that happens maybe we can help you deal with it a little better but yeah who wrecked your penny the woman as she was just doing her job i guess you know but i, I, I was mad at myself not anybody else because all I had to do, well, I didn't know. But, I mean, if I would have just scanned that freaking shockwave thing the right way, that woman never would have came over. Uh, she was like in La La Land. Uh, I would have scanned it, would have came up as a penny, and I would have walked out of there for $15. Would have got a 56-piece shockwave kit. And a 18 volt rigid compressor. 15 bucks, and it will be going right to you. Well, the Patriots, I mean. But we are doing a huge Christmas giveaway for you guys also uh, on YouTube. And this, I think, is going to be part of our Christmas giveaway. Now, there's going to be a whole bunch of stuff. This is going to be the biggest Christmas giveaway ever. But I do want to thank this company, uh, Urseri. Now, they contacted me. Now, I get a lot of um, companies that contact me wanting to review their stuff. And I usually don't, don't do any of these companies. Um, you know, it's a lot of Amazon stuff. And, you know, you don't know. And they don't even write to you. They're like, it's all, like, broken English. And I'm like, eh, you know what? I don't... And they want, And what's funny about that is they want you to do... Like, they kind of give, yeah, we're going to send you this $10, um, I don't know, $10 impact driver. I don't know, it's probably $20. Uh, this is what we want done. One, two, three, four, five. I'm like, uh, I don't need your $10 impact driver, buddy. But this company, the guy was very nice. Um, totally understood him. And before I said yes, I looked up the reviews. I looked up the specs i looked up the company i looked up a lot and i was pretty impressed with the reviews and of course the price and i think that is what's pretty awesome about this i haven't opened it i don't know what's going this took it out of the box let me just make sure all right uh but what's cool about it is it's a complete kit so not only is it a um you know a drill driver with the battery but it comes with some bits and everything here now it is made in china but um it looked really good i mean i, I read some of the review of, of the some of the reviews now yep yeah it did it really did uh it comes with a six millimeter masonry drill bit a regular drill bit four millimeter five millimeter three millimeter two millimeter a, a drill adapter a Phillips and a flathead, a looks like a small 
they call it a magnetic bit tip holder looks like a nut driver oh uh, probably it may be an adapter and you got a drill flexible shaft hmm a shaft but let's take a look and this is the website um they have a lot of stuff uh, i know uh, you know besides before they contacted me um you know i didn't i never heard of this company to be honest with you but again really good reviews and not only on this on a couple other things that i saw but let's check her out and we'll go over the price too so this is a um you know guys something again for the price to keep in the truck now th this comes with the whole shabat oh this is really light like super light i like this case um you know to slide underneath you know your seat or something if you kind of need a drill you don't really want to spend a lot of money um you know obviously you know even for the diy guy um or honestly you kind of maybe you got a a buddy that kind of just moved into a house or something and you know you know he doesn't care what you know you don't want to spend a lot of money on him on a freaking makita or uh you know the wall you know kit or something but um yeah uh you siri uh kit here we'll take a let me move the box here but i'm like yeah you know what this would be good and we'll do a give we'll, we'll include this in the christmas giveaway and uh someone will get a nice little drill driver hopefully all right so you do get a warranty so this beats the let's see how long it is here Thank you for choosing your Siri. We hope you enjoy using this convenience, quality, and affordability of your your Siri products. Any problem occurs, just please reach out to a customer service via email, Facebook, or through your Siri official stores. Hmm. I just want to know how long it is. I don't know. Here's your little manual. All right, so here it is, guys. Um, it's right. It has eighteen. Let me see. Yeah, eighteen chuck positions. Now, from what I found out on this, wow, it's actually a very comfortable little uh, drill driver here. So it has thirty-six uh, newton meters. All right, Nm. So this has around three hundred and nineteen inch pounds of torque. Which is pretty shocking. 319. Hmm. I think that was it. Yeah, three, 36 Newton meters it was. Um, the battery obviously needs to be charged. Um, you got a 16.8 volt battery that comes with this. Um, you got the 18650 cells. Uh, 2,000 milliamp hour cells are in here uh it's their own battery which is again kind of shocking usually they kind of you know um and this kind of looks just like the old makita writing doesn't it remember if anyone has the old makita 12 volt the writing is so much alike that's actually pretty funny um yeah they're all labeled and they have a little date 2018 07 1807 so made in july of 2018 but um you know obviously this is for the value um consumer uh you got two um speed settings on it is that a sense time oh <laughs> Looks like a ripoff of the... Yeah, right, William? William Pearson? It does. I'm telling you. Of the old... Yeah, because I think... Didn't Makita have an old 10.8? Before they had the 12. They used to label them 10.8. Very similar. Um, But, yeah, so, you know, a pretty comfortable dr little drill. You know, I'm, I'm pretty surprised at the power of it. Um... You know, being a 16.8, they actually tell you 2,000 milliamp hour. Yeah, 36 Newton meters. They put everything kind of right on the, the drill, too. Um, setting one will give you 0 to 400 RPM. 
and setting to 0 to 1400. Chuck size 0 to 10. Yeah. 16. It does. It's a little bit longer. Not, you know, to be honest with you, it, it's obviously it's brushed. It has a brushed motor in it. Um, we got some rubber over molds here and up on top. If this is rubber. Obviously, like I said, you got many different truck settings. Let me uh, get the old uh, tripod here. But no, 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 no. We don't want that. We don't want that. So yeah, I don't know why this is zooming in so close now. It's kind of really irritating me. It's too close. They must have did something. I don't like that. But yeah, so um, obviously very simple to kind of get your setting. You got um, a drill mode right there. So if you're doing some drilling with her, you can do that. And then you got your torque settings, you know, up to 18. Obviously 18 being the max here. Um, you know, not bad. You know, nothing special, guys. Uh, I'm not going to, you know... Uh, if you're looking for something, uh, a complete kit where you're going to get the actual drill driver and you know, it's something small, but it has a lot of power. So it's something light, um, you know, for the females, again, if you don't really use a drill that much and you don't want to spend a lot of money, you kind of just use it here and there. Um, you know, $40, um, yeah, well, when you compare it to, you know, Harbor Freight, uh, what's the Harbor Freight real cheap? The Harbor Freight, um, was it like Drill Master or something like that? What's up, Nathaniel? Bean Town Boy. Well, what's 26 times 12? Bean Town Boy. Do, 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 do. 26 times 10 is 260. So, yeah, probably, like I said, 319 inch pounds. Warrior, all right, Warrior, right. There's Warrior, there's like Drill Master. Um, guys, I can tell you from picking this up, and I've picked many of those Drill Masters, and the, there's a, the Warrior just came out, so I, I did pick it up, but, um, you know, definitely, I think you're going to be better off, and especially with what you get, um, you know, you get the battery, you get the charger here, um, you get a nice little hard case here, but you get, you know, a whole bunch of little accessories that are pretty cool. Like I said, I went over it. I'm going to give this to somebody, so I'm not going to start finger snapping all this stuff. I'll leave it in here, but you get some nice uh, bits in here. Actually, whoa, I want that. I'm getting a couple of nice torques in there, man. Um, but yeah, look, you get a couple. Yeah, you got some sockets on here. Not bad. And you get this sucker, man. This is like really cool, man. Yeah, baby. So, uh, if you kind of got to get in something that's, you know, a little, uh, little, uh, hard there, and you really can't get her in there, man. You know what I'm saying? Oh, check this out. Whoa, baby, go crazy. Oh, let's go crazy. Let's get nuts. But, yeah, if you got to get in, uh, it's a pretty cool little... You know, um, obviously we've all seen these. I haven't seen one this long. Um, you know, you can obviously bend and shape it into an area. Um, and you got a couple different, like I said, um, and you can obviously use any, you know, bit you want. But it comes with an assortment. But, you know, say you kind of got to get behind that, you know, little thing like there. Or, you know, you guys know what I'm saying. So, pretty cool, guys. Um, 
again, I'll have the link below. Uh, nice people over there. They just really cool. Like, hey, man, you want to check this out? And I said, what do you got? And I said, they sent me a couple things. I'm like, you know what? I see you have a drill. Send me the drill. And uh, I'll show it, and I'm going to give it out to somebody. And Christmas is coming up. But, yeah, not bad, guys. I mean, you know. Forty dollars, thirty nine ninety nine. Um, I think they said that they were gonna give a discount code, or maybe that was another company. I don't know. I don't think so. But it's thirty nine ninety nine. Um, you know, again, if you're not looking, here's your little battery indicator. So obviously, this needs to be charged because this should be all green. You want all green. I've never seen it on the side. Hmm. But, um, yeah, so they got some other stuff. You can check it out. I'll, I'll put the um, their website up, too, if you want to check some of their stuff out. But, yeah, 36 Newton meters, uh, again. So around 319 inch pounds, again, which is, you know, for a little 16 volt. Not bad. Uh, it's small, compact, um, it comes with one battery, uh, 2,000 milliamp hour, 18,650, um, 16.8 amp, uh, 18 settings, you got your drill setting, of course, um, yeah, pretty nice, you know, for 40 bucks, again, um, instead of going to Harbor Freight and spending, you know, 30 or 40 dollars on a drill master or a warrior and they might not be that much i don't know i don't know what's the drill master 1999 or one of them's 19 one's 29.99 i believe um one of them is i don't know hmm. i don't remember but so for a couple bucks more you can get something like this if you want something smaller um but totally all up to you. And again, you do get some nice uh, accessories that come with it. Uh, you got a nice little case here. You can put your charger and all that goody stuff. Goody two shoe. I don't think that goes like that. But yeah, so not bad. I was very upset about that today at the Home Depot, to be honest with you. Um, I would have loved to have gotten that for that price. I would have gotten it for 50 I even I said it. I'm like, can I pay 50 No, unfortunately, we can't do that. I'm like, I just want this thing. You're like, what are you doing with this? Oh, uh, when we're done, uh, we're going to write it off and we're going to throw it in the garbage. I'm like, oh, okay, you're going to throw it in the garbage. I mean, I'm going to give you 50 bucks for it. Oh, uh, so sorry. I mean, unbelievable. Absolutely unbelievable. Freaking believable. I think that's... Yeah, 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 yeah. Get that little slip in there. And you get in there, too. So, yeah, we're going to give this sucker away um, uh, part of a big prize pack. Uh, I don't know, guys, what we'll do. Uh, maybe first, second. You know, it's coming on so quick, guys. Uh, Christmas, it's, it's crazy. Um... You know, we were talking about the uh, the generators and the snow blowers are already out, and it's absolutely insane. But uh, for the Patriots, that is going to be part of it. That uh, Milwaukee kit. I'm going to see if I can get my hands on another rigid compressor somewhere, because that would have been the cat's meow. Yeah, it was very, you know, I'm like, listen, I'll, I'll buy for 50. It's, I, I thought I was paying 50 for it. It's like, no. I'm like, what are you going to do with this thing? The box is all ripped. There's all There was mustard on the side of the box. Some yellow substance. Could have been cat urine. I mean, who knows? I'm like, I'll give you 50. She, no. I got to know. I was like, yo, you're selling this to me. She said, step away. I'm like, you know. I was getting this for an injured friend. And she's like, I'm sorry to hear that, but, you know, we're, we're going to write this off and uh, we'll throw it in the garbage. Less than 100 days. Yeah, man. 
It is. It's sick. Eagle Jam's talking about tacos. Yeah, I hear tacos are big in California. They got like the, the carts that drive around. Harbor Freight, the most variety of Chinese-ism you can find outside of Beijing. I spent 30 plus on tacos. We're off another 10 bucks. You get yourself a Yuseri. Yeah. Makita Detail won the model. Okay, that was it, William. I thought, yeah, the battery looks very, very close. It's basically an exact copy design. Yeah, you know, it. Uh, I think it's this is bigger, a little bit bigger. I have the uh, that old white Makita, um, the 12 volt, and it's not as big as this. But maybe the design. Wrench Rage, hey, what's up, y'all? I'm back. Yeah, where you been, man? That happens when there's no lubrication. Hey, what's up, Evans Auto Repair, man? Good to see you. Ruben! Hey, Ruben, I got your message there. I I'm going to res respond to it. Stubby made a bloody. Shout out from Port Drum uh, Portland, Oregon. All right, bro. Dan, C145. All right, Chicago Electric. Yeah, guys, I think Chicago Electric, I saw something. I, I, I talked about it when I was at Harbor Freight last time. Uh, I think Harbor Freight is working on a brushless um, platform. Uh, I don't think it's going to be big. Uh, I think it's going to be like a drill driver, an impact, maybe a hammer drill to start with. I think it was Chicago Electric, guys. Um, I think it was them. I could be wrong, but they're going to have some kind of brushless platform there very soon. Um, <laughs> EJM, this is the new DeWalt brushless model that I was talking about. Yeah, you know, listen. Yeah, you know, Big Beaks, I just got an email about the new Milwaukee heated gear. And I'll tell you, you know, if you saw the MPS 18 video, you heard me uh, talk about all the new stuff. Um, they got this one jacket, this one, I mean, not a jacket. This is a winter coat, bro. Um, <clears throat> the thing looks awesome. <clears throat> they got a whole new line of uh, beanies and, you know, winter hats and stuff uh, this year. Uh, gloves. Yep. Um, yeah, you know, the problem with the heated stuff, like I told you, um, that you guys love it. <coughs> Excuse me. I just had a, but the stuff like sells itself. I mean, I don't know if that's true because I, I, you know, I've done videos where I, you know, the one coat I got, I mean, I got the nice black winter coat with the battery for $70. But last year when I talked to, uh, my little friend over there, <coughs> she's like, I'll be honest with you. You know, I can't even send you one because uh, we don't have any left. And to be honest with you, we're not even promoting it because it, as soon as it hits the stores, it's gone. And um, I think last year might have been the first year for that. Um, you know, I got my coat probably two years ago. Um, the one coat. Excuse me. Uh, but last year, the, the heated stuff did really, really well. Um even Sean Perry, Benjamin SPJ, whoa, Sean SPB, excuse me, he, he did snorkel, what, underwear kit, yeah, I mean, they have a, the skin, actually, I got, I got something from Milwaukee, you know, tomorrow, actually, I got one of their, uh, I won't tell you, but tomorrow, we'll have some of their um, outerwear, it just came in last week. I was in Cooperstown when it came in. I bought my dad the Ryobi drill driver for his birthday. Oh, that's cool, Steve. And uh, Steve is now pretty close to me. So Federer 2001 and me are going to have to partay. Milwaukee needs to make a long sleeve shirt. that I hack EJM. Watch tomorrow night. Watch tomorrow night. Well, now, it doesn't run on any type of battery, but it is a long sleeve shirt. But... Harbor Freight has a dead body in the store decomposing. I want the Axis vest and the hoodie. Wow, yeah, it's good. Well, I'll tell you, the new Tool Boss gear, then I'm thinking about getting some hoodies. We're going to get some maybe some hoodies made up, too. 
I've been getting a lot of the comments, emails about you guys want hats and and hoodies. CT, what's up, Charlie Thompson? Yep, Harbor Freight has Bauer and Hercules brands now. Both a big waste of money. Bauer and Hercules. I wouldn't go near. There's no need to go near. Not saying that they're bad. But for the cost, you're not gonna you're not gonna come out on top buying them. Oh, hi Ridge Handyman, yeah. Did you send me your address, Hi Ridge Handyman? I know I got to send one out to Noah. Noah is starting school. Noah Sorensen, if you know, remember him, he's on here. And he just bought a hard hat. And he wants this sticker on his white hard hat. And I just ordered 50 more of these, by the way. 50 more. Snicker Mule had a deal. Yeah, send it to me again, High Ridge, man. Definitely. I, I, I got to mail some stuff out this week. Done deal. John Lane, done deal hoodies. All right, guys, that's really it. Um, so, again, thank you to you, the, the guy was very nice. Uh, Usuri drill driver, 16.8 volt, 319 inch pounds, uh, battery, charger, bunch of accessories. We're going to give this out on Christmas part, not only. We're going to have a lot of stuff we're going to do. Um, yeah, not bad. Uh, you know, something definitely to, to, to think about. Uh, the reviews are great. Um, yep, you get a lot of bits with it. Um, and I said, I told them I'm, I'll definitely um, talk about it and do a little giveaway. So maybe one of you guys would enjoy this. So that's about it, folks. I wanted to do that for them. And I wanted to tell you what happened with the rigid which was just unspeakable, unspeakable, but the Patriots, um, you, that, uh, 56 piece shockwave is going to go out in September. I'm going to do the video right after this, after I have my decaf cup of coffee. Um, and I'm going to throw some other stuff in it. Oh, you're going to get the shirt. So you're going to get the shockwave kit. You guys have seen it. You're going to get a Milwaukee shirt. This is just for now. October, guys, remember, is the Bosch kit. You're going to get a combo kit, Bosch, two batteries, two tools, the whole shebang of wanger. That's for October for the Patriots. And you're going to get your choice of one of these auto locks. Hopefully, you take the 25-footer. Because I know this is my last 16-footer. So you're gonna get the shockwave with this with the store. I should just I can't believe it. Hold on a second here. It's in the car. It's in the car. I left it in the car. The other one here. No, that's not it. Where's my freaking? Where's my freaking? Where is my freaking? Oh, yeah, you know what we're going to do? And you get a tick. Check this out, dude. Wow, this is a great one for this month, man. So you're going to get a tick. A auto lock. Too damn nice, man. A t-shirt and that 56 piece with the self-storage. I'd show it to you if I freaking knew what the freak. I know I put it in one of my tool belt boxes, bags. Oh, did I tell you what I did with the wearer here? I was going to do a separate video on that. You guys know um, I got this beautiful case. I did a video on it. I, this is where I've been rocking with my ratchet. Now, this is my... All right, guys, I'm going to be totally honest with you. No lie. Um, I, I I lie. I use this one, man. I don't... I, I have only, Yeah, I like this one. I haven't been using the brushless one too much. So, um, I mean... 
I can't lie and say I like the brushless one better. I, I like the old version. Now, I like the power better in the brushless, of course, but um, it's too big. It, uh, the head is too big, and I just find it to be not as satisfying to use, personally. And here goes cheap warrior crap. But I had to use this. I had actually a drill in here. This is a great little case. I actually really like it. Um, and it there's a whole system. I, I talked about it. You got the Velcro on the back. So if you want to stick it on the wall. But this is the... Um, I have to make a video so you guys, the Patreon, Patriots, Patreons can do it. So you get a tape measure, a tick. And you guys know what shockwave kit I'm talking about. Son of a bitch. Yeah, you guys know what I'm talking about. It's got the self-storage, man. You saw it today. I want to show it just so it kind of gets you guys off my nerves. You know what I'm saying? Oh, great. That freaking thing, man. It fell over. All right, so you get the 56-piece shockwave with the removable storage. Um, we did a video on it. You're going to get a tick, a auto lock, a t-shirt also. I'm trying to fit everything in that $7 bag there for you people, so you know what I'm saying. And this will do a Christmas, people, but Christmas is going to be good. We're going to have a nice, big, uh, for all you, awesome subscribers. So, if you use the Milton M. Style Air Fittings Armor for what is it? Oh, it's bad, Big Beaks. Oh, really? AJM. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Told us I have the rigid Job Max ratchet head that is not available anymore i'm thinking of getting the brushless ratchet one day i don't know man you know it kind of if you guys remember that there was a lot now to be honest with you this the 12 volt ratchet is probably one of the top three most popular tools in that entire 12 volt platform uh and people have been dying for years oh they got to come out with a brushless uh with a little bit more power and they did exactly kind of what we wanted but I mean, it's really double the weight, and it's really, you know, I don't want to say double the size, but, um, you know, the thing with the ratchet is, too, is, you know, it's a ratchet, so you you just crank it. You crank it like a regular ratchet when you have to. You know, what's good about the brushless one, especially doing oil changes, is, you know, this ratchet, the, um, the brushed, you can't even get the... Uh, you know, the drainage plug out and they're, you know, what, 25, 30 foot pounds. They're, you know, supposed to be torqued at. Um, but with the brushless, I mean, comes right off. So, I mean, what's up? Hey, Johnny J. Thomas Carroll. Yeah, we're, Christmas, we got the big Christmas one coming up, and there's one every month on the Patreon. What's up, Handy? Whoa, I got the new Milwaukee Ratchet, kicks ass, it blows it. Yeah, well, and it's also probably a third of the price, John. Yeah, I mean, if, you know, it's, again, it's not, it's not that it's bad. Yeah, hey, Steven, am I coming to Texas? Um, My man, Tool Guy Ty who my prayers are with, guys. Um, you know, his dog passed away. If you're just joining us. But I've talked to him now for probably two years. We've been buddies on here. And uh, he's been trying to get me to come out to Dallas. Um, but yeah, man. It's definitely something to, you know, think about. To be honest with you, man. But, um, yeah. Yeah. All right, so that's it, guys. Let me get out. Um, but that's about it, people. 
So I will check you guys on the flip. I will see you. I'm going to try to get that freaking compressor if it's the last thing I do. But guys, check your stores for that compressor. You guys are out in California, man. 94 store. But I'd come out to, to uh, there would be nobody else I'd rather see. I mean, but he's all the way out there, man. That's like, that's like, yeah, the brushless one fourth is about the size of the brush three eighths. I don't, John, I think the one fourth brushless is even bigger than the three eighths. It's definitely heavier. Might not be bigger, but yeah, maybe, you know, the head is probably about the same. I would drive to Dallas. Yeah, well, I'll come. Where, where are you at, Steven? We'll do the freaking tour, baby. The Tool Boss bus is driving to Texas. Oh, Tyler, Texas. That's a nice little ritzy town there from what I hear. Naples, Florida never got sales. They're suck. Yeah, Florida, man. Florida is great from october actually november 1st to april 1st it's probably the best state in the country after that oh man let me tell you you know, for all you people who think you know it was a hot summer and here in the northeast it was a brutal hot summer we had three no i don't know if it was either two or three 90 degree days in 2017 for some reason i'm thinking it was two i heard it on the news okay two in 2018 we had 16 days so eight times hot and when it wasn't 90 man it was like 88 it was like 87 it was brutal i mean it was 84 today and just humid it's been hot but Florida, man, is like, you know, I went to Florida uh, probably s seven or eight years ago, man, for like the first time, you know, the whole Disney thing. They got mosquitoes like birds, bro. They're like the size of birds, these freaking bugs, mosquitoes, man. I mean, the heat, it just hits you. You get kicked right in the groin. If you're a male, if you're a female, it's kind of like getting kicked in like the sternum in the belly in the in the upper is almost maybe like a liver kick a real hard liver kick where you just pretty much just collapse yeah and i'm talking like eight o'clock in the morning you kind of just oh wow it's sunny out and then it's like whoosh, 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 whoosh. i'm in houston so i felt yeah texas is hot don't tell i know that man Oh, New Jersey is like, man, you don't understand. New Jersey is, it's a one, the whole state is a city. Now, we have mountains and all that. I don't want to say that, but you got 8 million people, okay? And, you know, a county in California. You know, some of these counties in Texas or California are like 8,000 square miles. New Jersey is only like 8,000 square miles. Now, we probably have 8,000 towns in those 8,000 square miles, but it's packed. You know, then we got New York City. You see, but what people, most people don't understand is, you know, Philadelphia is really New Jersey, and New York City is really New Jersey. So you got them two also, right? And you got New Jersey in the middle. So you see what I'm saying? It's like, uh, uh. Perfect weather, good food every corner. I moved to Tyler six months ago. Memphis, yeah, Tennessee gets hot. Down south gets hot. I mean, I'm telling you. And North Carolina is hot, too. Oh. I mean, EJM, well, obviously EJM and 94GT are from California. But, um, you know, I heard it was really hot. Like San Diego, usually, and you would know. I mean, we all know the rumors, San Diego. It's 70 degrees all year long. I heard it was in the upper 90s this summer. I mean, the solar minimum is going to create that, the grand solar minimum, which we are in right now. Um, you're going to have just 
crazy weather. You know, a lot of people think it's just cold, you know, during a solar minimum. You're going to have intense, and we are. You guys haven't seen anything yet. For those who live in the Northeast, those who lived live in the, the Midwest, you know, those who live in the Northwest, last year's winter, oh, for you, that was, man, we're going to be praying for that. It's going to get worse and worse for the next 50 years. Oh, yeah. But the solar minimum is just very weird weather changes, fluctuations, like 90 degrees one day, the next day, 40. I saw, no, New Jersey is a, I mean, there's no state that honestly, you know, you got the biggest city in the world, you know, 30 miles away. You got beautiful mountains. You got the Appalachian Trail. You got the beaches. You got over 100 miles of beaches. You got Atlantic City. The ga you can do anything in New Jersey. You got the horse tracks. You got sports gambling. You got, you know, the best schools in the country. I mean, it's a very, very expensive state to live in, of course. Um, but, yeah, the weather once you know your normal northwestern i mean northeastern state type weather you know pennsylvania maryland uh you know not too brutal of winters now snow but i mean the last two winters like zero i'm talking like every freaking day you woke up every morning this past winter and it was like either two degrees below zero or like six Today's high is going to be six. Patrick Morris loves New Jersey. Yeah, Pocono. I mean, it's a it's located. It's the mecca of the world. This, this is the mecca of the world, man. I live less than 10 minutes from the coast. Yeah, we're EJM. Uh, I think nine, 94... I don't know. I forget. I know you're in California. Somebody's from Fresno. And then I think someone's by the... I think EJM is by the ocean, like he says. You know what, Beantown boy? I don't mind the snow. I mean, yeah, you shovel it, it's done. And I make money when it snows. But the, the zero degrees um, for, you know, three weeks straight that we had in January... I mean, the brutality of January 2018, where the entire month, like the highest temperature was 17. That, no. Fresno, you're at, Fre no, 94 is not Fresno. You're not in Fresno, are you, 94? I know somebody was from, I don't think it was either one of you two. Yeah, you hear about the rat apocalypse? Rats in Japan? 100,000 rats, they tore down this Chinese, this old fish market in Japan. It's been there for like 100 years. They've gotten so big that they have to expand. They have to finally get a new building. So they're closing down, and I guess rats love seafood. They love fish and all, like the trimmings. They cut the, you know, that's a fish market. In Japan, they eat the fish, man. They love it. Yeah, Ruben, they love it. Um, from North County, South Dakota. Um, but they're all, the, the rats were inside the seafood place. They were living a hundred thousand rats, you know, in the pipes, in the, the drainage systems and the sewers all in this building, you know, not that really, it's a pretty big building, but nothing, but now that they have moved, they're hitting the, they're like everywhere because they don't have that food to eat anymore. Their whole, I mean, that seafood place, the fish place fed a hundred thousand rats for like a hundred years. They've been living there eating and gorging on, you know, fish carcasses and, and fish, fish, you know. And now they've hit the streets. They're calling it the rat apocalypse. Ooh. 
William Pearson, yes, very nice. Military base is less than 10 minutes from me. Marines are made. Oh, okay. All right, you're over there. There, okay. I was asking myself on Sunday why. Yeah, man, it's the humidity where I'm at is this brutal. Like 100 today. Yeah, I mean, wouldn't it 100 degrees? And it's like, honestly, like a week from October, man. It's crazy. And you're going to see it. I'm telling you right now, guys, you are going to see it. You know, I don't know. You know, it's 100 in Texas, uh, Tool Guy Ty. It was 85 here. I don't know. Maybe not 80, maybe 82 or 83 today, but like humid. I mean, just I had baseball practice. I was soaked when I was done. But it's hot everywhere. And you're just going to see. You know, it'll be like 80, 82, 85, then drop down to 80, then 79, 74, then go to 76, then 30, then 30, 39 degrees or something. You're going to have just fluctuations. I was lost my toll ticket on the New Jersey Turnpike. I was charged full price. Oh, man. I mean, New Jersey is the toll booth state. I'm telling you right now. You know, they should put it right on the license plate. You know, I don't know what it says now. Uh, what, the Garden State? Fuck that. The toll booth state. They should write it right on the bottom of the license plate. Yeah, you're right. Hell, I can't back out of my driveway. Except some schmuck in a hat wants 20 cents, 25 cents. Yeah, it's true. Put it right on the license plate. The toll booth state. Hell, I can't back into my driveway. Some schmuck wants 25 cents. No tolls or rats here. Oh, he's from South Dakota. Minnesota, you get extremes, yeah. My buddy. Check him out on Instagram. These guys had a great show. And still on all the time. Rustic Renovations. The Jurgensons. Good good guys. Tax you to death. Oh, it's unbelievable. I You wouldn't believe what I... Pay. I don't even want to get into it. When they do artillery drills. Yes. Oh, definitely. The Garden State. Don't forget. Oh, Ruben. Yeah, the Garden State. Yeah, if you're building smokestacks. Right, put it right on the license plate, Ruben. The toll booth state. Hell, I can't back out of my driveway, except some schmuck wants 25 cents. Oh, you were born in New Jersey, Stephen? Oh, that's great. Wow, I've been on here for 53 minutes talking about, like, rat apocalypse. All right, let me get out of here. Dan, thank you, got bud. Ruben. Guys, the Patriots, I'll have this up. All right? You got to just comment under the video if someone's getting this. All right? Peace.